Now to new information about the University of Southern Indiana making the move to Division I and its impact on the city of Evansville. Eyewitness News to Sherian McBroom explains what the community is saying about the D1 move. With USI moving to the Division I level, we take a look at what that means for USI students as well as the Evansville community. Many students like freshman D'Angelo Allen are excited for USI to take a step up. Not only does Allen believe the move is good for college athletics, but also great for recruitment of non-athletes as well. I feel like it would make it a lot better and give them a higher chance of wanting to come here, you know? Knowing that my college went to D1, you know, that gives a lot of people more options to choose from. With the help of Evansville Sports Corporation, the city also hosts a Division II Men's National Championship for basketball. The corporation has historically worked with the university to host the championship, but the corporation's president, Eric Marvin, says they are confident they will still be able to bring major events to Evansville. We have had some preliminary conversations with the NCAA about that and, and definitely feel very optimistic that we'll still be able to host that championship uh, you know, as contract and moving forward. The news that there may making the transition just means that we have to reach out to uh, our, our championship managers with the NCAA and, and ensure that uh, you know we communicate with the committees that oversee each of the sports that we're working with. 2022 will mark the 27th year Evansville has hosted the Division II Men's Basketball National Championship game, a feat that brings revenue to the area. These events bring you know, hundreds of thousands of dollars or in some cases millions of dollars in economic activity to the region uh, and really help um, identify Evansville on a regional and national uh, landscape and they, they really help us create an identity for who we are. As USI makes the transition, students could also see a change in student fees rising to help balance the cost of a higher division university. I feel like a lot of people would be pretty upset about that, but I mean, then again, it is what it is. If that's how it's got to be, then that's how it's got to be. You know, like there's not much else we can really do about it. You know, you just got to keep going and push forward. The Evansville Sports Corporation says they plan to continue working with the university and other avenues. Reporting on the campus of USI, DeSherry and McBroom, Eyewitness News.